DJI Mavic 3, cruise control, set up and test. Got that coming up next. Bill the Drone Reviewer here. If you like the content of this video or anything on my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any future content. With that, let's begin. The DJI Mavic 3 Classic has finally arrived. With that, the DJI Mavic 3 owners got a gift as well. DJI put out a firmware update. And in that firmware update, there were two new features, night mode, which we'll see in a future video, and cruise control. Today, I went ahead and did cruise control. Now we're gonna walk you through the setup and the test, and I did the test in normal, cine, and sport mode. So without any further ado, let's roll that clip in its entirety. Set up cruise control, you go to the settings menu, control, select C3 button, control, and then select cruise, and you're all done. Okay, today we're gonna take up the DJI Mavic 3, and it's had a firmware update, and amongst the things we're gonna be testing today will be cruise control. So let's go ahead and get this show on the road. Got 14 satellites, looking real good. We're up about 100 feet here. So we're gonna go ahead and get video on. There we go. We do 4K 30 frames per second here. Got that set. All right, recording is on. Uh, let's go ahead and go. And then we're going to use, like I said, we're going to go ahead. Let's adjust that gimbal here a little bit. There we go. And now we have enabled cruise control. You can see my hands are off the sticks right here. Look at this. This is just absolutely amazing. I love this. This may be one of my favorite features that DJI has ever done. I absolutely love this. And there's a sign on the screen that tells you the cruise control is in use. Okay, I've disabled cruise control. And we're going to go ahead and fl flip her around here, or adjust it. And head this way. Again, the sign cut pops up on the screen that cruise control is in use. And it's at 33.4 miles an hour. Now you can make course corrections as I'm doing right here. The flight path, but again, it is just this is an absolute joy. And of course, to stop the cruise control, you just have to hit the same button that you customized. And then we'll come up to the intersection. And we're going to go ahead and stop. And disable cruise control. So let's go ahead and flip things around here. See a lot more construction has been taking place down by where we live here. We've 
naval cruise control again. Flying over some of the construction sites right now. Heading over the entrance to the development. Constant, um, right around 30 miles an hour. 33 miles an hour here. Flew overhead here. It is a little breezy today, so um, I mean I did expect that to actually happen. Um, okay, we disabled cruise control, so let's flip it around here. Now we're going to go, I'm going to do this in cine mode, slow speed. So we're going to go ahead and crank that up, but it's going to just be at right around 10 miles an hour. So now one thing that's really nice about this is if you're wanting to do a lot of adjustments with your shutter or, uh, want to take pictures this allows you the ability to do that with taking your hand off the controller which is absolutely fantastic and this is staying at a constant 11 miles an hour which is which is awesome here Again, shooting in 4K30. And there we are, overhead. And it's right around 11 miles an hour. Again, it probably takes into account uh, the altitude it's at and the wind speed and atmospheric conditions and things like that regarding the cruise control. That's just a guess on my part, but I, I believe that's probably correct. Making a little bit of course corrections here. Flying over the entrance to the development. Again, you can see all the new houses that are being started here. Wind's picking up a little bit here. Coming up to the intersection. Have sixty six percent battery. And because this is going so slow, I'm not going to shut cruise control off, and we're going to head in the other direction here. And 
that was successful. You can maneuver. This will enable you to maneuver to do fantastic shots. I really like this. I'm going to disable it here and then we're going to kick it in sport mode and okay it is now in sport mode And it's going along at about 39 miles an hour. Okay, we've disabled cruise control. And we're going to do return to home. Go home. It didn't hit the pad, but it was a very successful test of cruise control with the DJI Mavic 3. Question of the day. What did you think of the DJI Mavic 3 cruise control set up and test? Let me know in the comments section below. Thanks so much for watching, and remember, it's a great day to fly.